as we look at these two boxers, it's intriguing. You know, we've talked about Lolito Donaire in his age. Two Showtime fights, then Rashid Warren, who he beat for the vacant title. And just into Styles, Ubali, a decorated amateur. It's Showtime! No need. Take this off, please. Take it off. Right here, Nonito, no, no, right here, facing me. Okay, right here. Mouthpiece, mouthpiece. All right, I got a left in your feet. Please listen and follow my instructions at all times. Protect yourself at all times. Fight hard, fight clean. In the twilight of his Hall of Fame career, can Donaire dance with destiny one more time? Get an assist from Father Time. It's time. The bell and round number one, the defending Chito Donaire in blue with orange trim. So he's a guy that brings some power and pop in there as well. Yeah, and expect Dubali to be higher, especially on the left-hand side. You know, when you think about prehensible, and here, Norito Donaire has a chance to... Yeah, we should point out that uh, if he were to win tonight, he would join in the sport. So we'll see if he can achieve that and make that list time. Right hand to the left hook and delivering a left to the body of his own. If you're Donaire, you will likely get some more off the timing of this fighter. You mentioned it at the top of the telecast as Donaire gets backed up by the left. Abner, you know, at, the, at his age and after what transpired in Japan, he left he whatever he has left at the storied Saitama Super Arena, but has effective combination. But that was, again, 18 months ago in both of these... He did talk about that. He did mention that he let his body heal. Jim feels powerful in this way. Can't say it enough. I think he should, he, just as he's doing right now, take about his the fact that he feels like he understands, you know, he's fought three of the last seven fighters. So I feel like I really honed in on it. So nice see. check left hook to the body. He's 11 and one at 118 pounds on of this bantamweight championship fight. Donaire doubles with the left hook against lefties as well as anyone we've seen in recent years, so that should be... The bell and round a right hand to the body by Donaire. And again, that foot... Donaire averages 49 punches per round against righties and 39 against lefties. How many punches against lefties? And one thing that Donaire and said, you know, which was really good, is that the body fighter and fighters like him are so easy to predict. Puncher that Donaire is, I think, he is just waiting for a right time. Here he is. Two decade career, 20th championship. A decade ago when he was a pound for pound stalwart with that patented left hook. And coming forward and nice counter left hook by Donaire. See, I kind of just see. Another counter right hand scores for Donaire. One thing that Ovali does, does right and wrong at the same time, that left hand. Yeah. That can cost him dearly if, you know, if he's catch with the left hook of Donito. Donaire yeah, split hand of Ubali. Yeah, we saw a famous counter left hook from Donaire in the 2007. One of the all-timers. Yeah. And, he, and, and lay it left hand, that right hand to hang out there, and boy, Donaire will make it pay. And of course, he made broken orbital bone, broken nose. Was knocked down into victory, but boy, it definitely summoned warrior no Donaire, who again says that the layoff is what transpires here again. Donaire countering with the right hand. And it continues to be Donaire effective with the... And don't forget the jab. And, and, and... We talk about uh, Norino Donaire. Oh, nice lead left hook. He is the 2012 Fighter of the Year. And here he 
by the way, one of the voices in the corner with them there was his wife, Rachel, who people at the gym helping him. But he Kenny Adams, one of them, an institution in the Yeah, he's trained, and, uh, which is interesting. And meanwhile, Ubal over 200 amateur bouts. You, you don't need to fight for everything in that household. Yeah. A minute gone here in the third is Ubal. Most of us were fighters. Oh, and beautiful left hand by Ubali. Ubali is, is fighting to find the range for his left. Yeah. He's got a very strong And this is the time where Donaire has to use feints. He's got a feint. Donaire obviously here at 38 past his physical prime, but he thinks he recaptured his peak technical form due to his riches of that. Again, been very effective on the counterattack, although as mentioned by Al Bernstein, Ubali is... That was a great uppercut by Ubali. Oh, and he tagged Donaire and Donaire. Donaire is ready with those counters every time. Oh, and the right hand lands after he met Donaire. As Ubali backs up to the ropes, the veteran Donaire goes to the body with the right, right left hook. And oh. Ubali! Five, six, seven, eight. You want to continue? Look over there, come to me. No, no need to Donaire. Ubali down for the first time in his career. Here Just gave him a second chance. He's gonna be okay. From Donair came courtesy of that left hook, a counter because no. far out. He did it there, and then another left hook later. Guess in the ref. that punch came before the bell. I think that was after the bell. But I don't know. I mean, the ref is a no need to Donair sending Nordin Ubali twice. <laughs> That was a great job, but the was pretty much over. Yeah, well, we saw him uh, again, the, the Deontay Reed fight, the dramatic knockdown in the 12th round. And here, you see him again giving Ubali a chance, and Ubali bouncing back pretty well. Remember, we talked about that uppercut from too far outside. That's exactly what Ubali did, and he was crunched. He did stagger Donair for a moment or two before he got hit with that. Uh, you know, I noticed. That made Ubali, and then he got caught with the hook again and went down. Another right, and Nordino Donaire tagging Nordino Ubali. Oh, and another this fight is still an interesting one. Oh, my. Tasting defeat. I told you. I told you I got the first knockdown. The uppercut from Obali that was from too far back. And this is after he had had uh, Ubali in trouble already, and there's that huge uppercut. 14 years ago, he be beat uh, Victor Chinian. 10 years ago, he, he gave us knockout of the year against Montiel. Now, he is the new WBC Bantamweight champion. Number nine, world champion. The Filipino Flash. No need to. Number nine, world champion. Don 